Okay, so when you land on the Office 365 homepage, you may notice some changes to the interface. The first thing you'll see here at the top is recommended actions. And so Microsoft is using artificial intelligence to predict uh, what it is you'll want to work on or need to work on for the day and surface those items to the top of your page. So here you'll see that uh, Matthew left a comment on a PowerPoint that we're working on. And so I could go here directly and click reply and see his comment and reply to him. Uh, here's another one that comes from email. So looking at my inbox, um, it's reminding me that I said I would follow up here with something. And so I could add this to my to-do list, or I could just go ahead and follow up with it now by responding to this person. And so this will be surfaced at the top. Below that, we're going to see our quick access items, which is all of the files that we are working with. Some of these come from email attachments. Some of these might be documents that we're collaborating with others on, or maybe it's a file you're working on on your own and you likely will want to get back into that document today. Now, you can go ahead and filter these, right, by recently opened, files shared with me, favorites if you're favoriting your files. Now, the other change here you'll notice is on the toolbar at the left-hand side. What you'll notice is some of the commonly accessed apps listed here. And there, there's a more link here with the three dots to more of the frequently used apps. You may notice here that, that OneDrive is not listed. So if you're looking for OneDrive, which is it, it kind of gets hidden with this new interface, you can access it on uh, through the waffle here. You'll see OneDrive there. Another way to get to it is this folder here that reads My Content. And so my, when we click on My Content, we're going to be taken again to all of our files that either we're working on or uh, we're collaborating on with others. Uh, and again, you can filter those here, just like on the front page. But then down here under Locations, we can go to Cloud Files. And here we're going to see everything that is living in the cloud on OneDrive or on a Microsoft team where we collaborate with others. Uh, but up here at the top right, you're going to see go to OneDrive and this will take you to your own OneDrive with all of your files. And so this is the new interface for Office 365. We just wanted to share out an update so you're all aware of what this new layout means and, and the purpose of it. All right, hope this was helpful. Have a fantastic day.